Howdy y'all, welcome back to another video. So you guys just missed it. I didn't have the camera ready or anything, but a, a little chipmunk just tried to jump up in my van. <laughs> Alright, today, today is supposed to be the last super nice day up here, like mid-70s. Beautiful sunny day. So, we gotta do stuff. So I'm gonna go to the local mechanic guy. I'm gonna get some new tires, because I desperately need new tires. Then we're going to go to a very small laundry mat, and I'm going to just do one load of laundry today. And then after that, I desperately have to go charge my batteries with my solar panels. And then I think we should go on a hike. Yeah, it should be a great day. I'm off today, thankfully. <laughs> Only two more days left of this full-time week, and then I'm part-time. And then we're going to be out here in the woods chilling. So that's the plan. Uh... I'm just gonna hit it right away. I'm not gonna make coffee this morning. I have a Red Bull in my fridge, so I'm just gonna <laughs> just gonna chug the Red Bull and call it good. All right, so here's the spot I'm at. Very beautiful morning. A little crisp. Leaves are falling a lot. This is the one spot I would kick the pizza on. There's the haunted toilet over there. Yeah, it's a pretty neat little spot. We're probably gonna be coming back here tonight. All right, driving and vlogging again. Uh, I just left the local mechanic guy. Got some tires, 60,000 mile tires. Oh, well, this is it. Oh yeah, my laundry soap leaked. There's soap literally everywhere in here. Oh, this is just lovely. It's always something. All right, so I'm looking at the games they got over here. Look at this. Shoots and ladders. How old is this? All right, y'all, so I got laundry done. Got the, our tires ordered. Didn't vlog too much other than that. It's still, it is only 11.48 still, so it's pretty early. I'm at my little chill spot here. I got my screen nuts up because there's still flies up here. It's really warm. I've got my little sun protector going. I got a pizza at the gas station. Charging this battery because it's completely dead from running my refrigerator. All right, here's my setup. Got the panels out. Got the little 40 water going. Got the 200 water going. So my Ford sink up here, like the screen doesn't turn on anymore. And sometimes when I open my door, it doesn't shut the radio off and stuff. So I don't know, it's like being all glitched out. So I'm gonna go ahead and unhook the battery. Cause I saw someone online say, if you unhook the battery, it'll like master reset it or something. I'm pretty sure I tried this though, and it still doesn't come on. So we're gonna go ahead and pop the hood and see if I can get the screen to work again. All right, well, let's see if disconnecting the battery fixed my Ford sink. I highly, highly doubt it. And nothing. What a shocker. Right, everyone so i came back to the campsite pulled up to the trailhead and parking lot was completely full there was nowhere for me to park so i just said screw it came back here this spot's not very far from the trailhead so we still got time we can go hike later tonight oh here comes a little chipmunk dude what's up little buddy what's up little buddy He's a brave little guy. Yeah, I could just reach out and pet him. All right, since we got some time to waste, we're gonna sweep this van out a little bit. She needs it. She needs it bad. Oh, little chipmunk dude is back. Hello, little buddy. swept out best as I can get it what I really need to do is like scrub it down because some of this dust and stuff is leaking through my back doors it just gets everything so dusty right here literally impossible to keep this van clean well I got the back swept about as clean as it's actually gonna get it's like literally impossible to keep this thing clean I could sweep it every day and it would probably still look 
<laughs> look dirty like this. My next thing to do in this van is get rid of this stupid foam crap bed that I've got. It overhangs by like a couple inches sometimes and it always slides out. I have it velcroed and everything. Yeah, that's gonna be the next upgrade. All right, yeah, so we're gonna go hiking. We It's gonna be dark in two hours, so we might be able to catch the sunset. Hopefully I got enough battery power because I can't seem to find I'm missing like three batteries for my camera, so hopefully I can find them. Otherwise, this might be a short hike for you guys. Just remembered, I forgot my flashlight because it's going to be dark probably by the time we get out of here. And I think I left my spoon or fork in the van. <laughs> So I don't think we're going to be able to eat up on top of the peak. I swear, it's always something. Oh yeah. Time for the rocks. This is where I'm going to run out of breath pretty quick. Because I'm out of shape. <laughs> All right, you're not gonna be able to see, but Carlton Peak is right up there. We're pretty much right at the bottom of it, so it's all uphill from here. Oh yeah, we're getting there. Oh, what is this? A little flag. Yep, I'm out of breath. <laughs> yes, of course. Ton of breakups on this wall. Love to see it. You know all these people broke up. This is the cool part of the trail. Walking along this big, big rock edge. Oh yeah. Oh, we're getting there. Ow. Ooh, this is it. The last stretch. I'm out of breath. Alright, we're almost to the top here. I think there's an old fire tower stands up here stuff. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a beautiful view. Hey, there's that spot I drove down to in one of my videos a few weeks ago. Alright, well, we made it to the peak. Here's a beautiful view up here. All right. Sun is going to be really bright for you guys. Pretty sure we're the only ones up here right now. So I'm pretty sure this is just a, a steep drop off. Ugh. I'm gonna go crawl down here. Check it out. I love me some cliff edges, guys. Oh, yes. Let's go a little closer. A little closer. All right. <laughs> That's probably good. Hole. Beautiful. Giving me vertigo a little bit. Alright, so we're gonna chill here. Let me see if I actually have a spoon. I think I do. Hopefully. 
Oh, oh no. Please be a spoon. Yes! Spoon. We can cook. Can't believe I remembered everything. That's amazing. Alright, so we're eating chicken teriyaki. Delicious. For you in here. Hopefully that's enough water. Alright. Let's give this a try. It's still pretty hot, so... Pretty sure I've, I've had this before in a video. Honestly, it's not that bad. Pretty decent. Well, the sun is just about to set over the horizon there. We're gonna go ahead and watch the sunset. And uh, I'm gonna have to walk back in the dark <laughs> with no flashlight. That should be fun. Hey Sandy, what he was wondering, there used to be a fire tower up here, way back in the day. Not anymore. Yeah, what a gorgeous view. Yeah, see now you can see the harbor where we were chilling earlier, charging my batteries. That's where we were. That's literally like seven miles away. That is crazy. Well, we better hit it while we still got some sunlight. Beautiful sunset. What a beautiful day too. Oh, it was so warm. So nice. Alrighty y'all. Let's head her back in the dark. It'll probably get dark once we get down into the woods here. Then we gotta go take a shower really bad. I'm nasty right now. Also, my battery is starting to die. And I don't think I have another full charged one. So I'll probably just see you guys back at the van and see you guys in the shower. Haha, <laughs> giggity. <laughs> Oh yeah, once you get down in the woods here, it's really dark. Wow, y'all, look how dark this is. You probably can't even see on the GoPro. I could barely see in person. Alright, I know you guys can't see anything, because I literally can't see anything myself. I can see, like, the light from the rocks. And that's about it. I think we're getting pretty close. Oh! I almost just rolled my ankle there. Made it. Lovely little shower at the hotel. All right. Well, I got gas. Going back my tiny little road here, my tiny van in the pitch black. Tell you what, people hate LED lights, but man, when you're out in the forest with them, oh. I would I wouldn't change my headlights at all. I love my LEDs. Alrighty everyone, so I'm back at the campsite that I was at earlier. Decided to get gas too since the gas station was right next to that hotel. Gas was 334, if you're wondering uh, around here. So yeah, I'm not gonna have a fire. I'm just gonna chill in the van here and probably start editing this video because I don't even know what happened in this video and I just recorded it today so <laughs> it's gonna be a pain to edit probably so hopefully you enjoyed whatever this video turned out to be and yeah I'll see you guys next week in another video so thanks for watching peace